So good as the dream is. It must have been what I see. Keeps in it. Nah. It keeps in it. Yeah. Chef? Ich bin echt befühlt heute. Hi, heute schon. Ja. Nein. <lacht> Sicher, aber wer ist noch? Was? Donnerstag. Ja, heute ist Donnerstag. Ah, ich hab nichts gesagt, Mann. <lacht> ich, ich, ich hab ja einen eindeutigen Beweis. Warum trinkst du Kaffee überhaupt? Ich trinke schon lange Kaffee, Mann. <lacht> das schaut aus nach Bier. Das ist Donnerstag haben wir gesagt. Ja, eh? Es ist Donnerstag. Nice, nicht. Hey, Chef, es ist Donnerstag. Scheiße, es ist schon Donnerstag. Hello and welcome back to another video, guys. Uh, you're probably wondering what are we doing here with this lovely camper. And honestly, I am wondering pretty much exactly the same thing. But Mani and me, we've been to so many mountain roads and every time we drive up there, we see one of these. And every time we think to ourselves, what are they doing here? Why are they doing this to themselves? This must be pain in the ass and it's just not fun and so. Mani and me bought one to finally experience it to the fullest and to finally understand what's so special about a camper van. Come inside, I show you around. Oh god, this uh, did I, I also started hunting like a few weeks ago and I shot this. Come, come inside, come here. I mean, you have everything you can possibly want. You have uh, some decoration. Yeah, this is the bed where I normally sleep always. Uh, it's about to do and hang up. He's safe. Lekos, was tut er da drin? Aus sie mit dir. Nein, das ist nichts. Nichts ist da drin. Ich schwöre, es ist nicht so, wie es aussieht, okay? Der Guckel. Come inside. Der Seifrech, yeah, wild und wunderbar. Das ist eigentlich sehr komfortabel. Es ist perfekt für mich. Und du kannst das auch hier down, wenn du willst. Dann ist es sehr dark. Okay, hier ist ein Toilet. Where you can go to the toilet? Invisible toilet or what? No, you just pee in the sink. It's There's some glasses. It's okay. It gives to them a little drunk. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, in here you have this. I also shot this. <laughs> With what? With a shotgun. This? Don't, don't worry about it. Here you can cook. You can cook dinner and stuff. It's We used it also. Um, you can also use it by driving. It's very cool. Amazing. And here is the sink. Let me just show. Nah. Beer. Beer and cola. How you like it, man? It's very good. Yeah. Come on, be honest. Yeah. It's so, very cool. Yeah. It's... We said we go camping. I bought a camper. What's the problem now? <laughs> no, it's, it's okay. So far, we've owned it for like 12 hours now and it's been great. 12 hours. <laughs> but yeah. It's hip. It's hip. Look, everybody always says the main reason why they don't have one of these to drive around is because it's so slow. This so and corner. We? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to prove you. It's not. It's it's a fun vehicle. You can have fun with it. You can actually drive really fast with it if you want. You can drive as fast as as you would normally drive. Well, everywhere. And to test this theory, we have some challenges for you guys. Some challenges with our camper vans. We're gonna take it to the racetrack. We're gonna take it to drag strip. We're gonna take it off roading. We're gonna take it drifting, and we're gonna cook in it. This is gonna be a fun few days. Welcome to the motherfucking camp life. <laughs> We're starting with the first of our challenges, with our lovely little camper van. We're starting off a bit slow because we need this trailer for like four more days. Yeah, I slept in here today and honestly nah. I have to... But nah. Du hast doch We are off to our first challenge now, which is we're in one of Europe's highest mountain roads and we have to drive up this with the trailer. Because like the main issue we always see is everybody goes up here so slow and I don't really understand that. So we're trying to figure it out. And at the same time, we have a little extra for you. Come back here. Because our lovely little friend Futi. Hey! <laughs> his mission today is to cook us something nice to eat while we drive up this very long and beautiful and definitely not twisty mountain road. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what's on the menu today? <laughs> two steaks, two with toast and rucola. Yeah, it's gonna be a delicious meal that we can hopefully enjoy properly once we get to the top of the mountain. Yeah, it's actually very simple. We drive up the road and Futi's cooking in the back for us in the meantime. Yeah, perfect. It's very good. <laughs> <laughs> Live cam. <laughs> ah, this is toll. If I wish I'd done this, man. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> to show you guys what a beautiful road we have here, it's definitely not very twisty. I think it's going to be perfect for Fuzi. <laughs> very comfortable for us, I have to say. I think Fuji is doing a great job in the back. Yeah. This actually might have been one of our best ideas ever. Yeah. Uh, and I'm very hungry. Yeah, I must say. Yeah. We get to drive up this beautiful road here, enjoy the scenery. Fuji is having the time of his life in the <laughs> <Yeah>. back. <laughs> He has a very good cooking skills, yeah. so 
Food is the perfect man. <laughs> Join the scenery with us. Very beautiful. Ah, Alpha. Yeah, so if you ever want to have a beautiful dinner with a nice view, you can book Fuzi, honestly. Yeah. Okay, we're nearly there, we nearly made it. Yeah. Then we can enjoy our delicious beer. Look at this view. Yeah, so we made it to the top. Perfect steak. Yes, for the old clone. I hope I this. Close up. Do you like it? Yeah. Boss, what's your problem? Ein Genießer. That was some really delicious food. I really enjoyed it and I'm glad we did this. That was a great experience to finally feel the van life properly, the camper life. So kudos Mani, kudos Fuzi. To a very Thanks. great cook. As you can see, we finished all the <laughs> we finished all the food. <laughs> and it was very good. We're gonna pack our things now and then it's time for the next challenge. Next one is going to be a bit more rowdy. I think we're going drag racing. <laughs> camper. So today we are at Rolling 402, which is one of Europe's most visited drag events. And we brought our lovely little camper to see how well this will perform on the drag strip. Honestly, the last few times I was on the drag strip, it didn't really end well for me because I always lost. But I have a strong feeling today is going to be different. Yeah, let's look forward to see what our competitors look yeah. like and then we can start. Yeah. <laughs> I think our camper is gonna be the fastest car of today's event. Yeah. Pizza. 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 They're not happy with it. <laughs> okay, I have to drive on my own. Well, okay, fuck it. <laughs> well, that worked fucking great. <laughs> I mean, I might have lost, but that was fucking amazing. <laughs> Chef! <laughs> yeah, so they kicked me off the event. So no more drag racing for me with my trailer. Oh. Very unfortunate. Would have been a lot of fun, but maybe next time we can at least try it. <laughs> so, yeah. But at least the trailer is fun for partying, I guess. Yeah, yeah, and welcome to a wonderful Salzburgring. Uh, we are here in a racetrack now with our lovely little camper. Honestly, when I called Salzburgring and told them about my idea, I didn't think they would say, yeah, come here, uh, we're gonna do it. But yeah, here we are. And as you can see, they allowed us to come here with our trailer. We're going to do this the following way. We're gonna drive one turn without the trailer, take the time, and then drive another turn with the trailer, take the time, see how much slower or faster we are with the trailer. Mm -hmm. My predictions are we're gonna be exactly the same fast. So yeah, let's get rid of the trailer first. <laughs> and then we yeah. can... Let's go. So, like I said, first things first, we're gonna take one lap time around Salzburgring without the trailer with my T-Rex, and then afterwards, we're gonna put the trailer on the car. 
I have to say, the brakes on the T-Rex are probably not the best. So we have to be, but the good thing is we can just drive around here. <laughs> okay, let's go. Yeah. So the good thing about the T-Rex is, that it's actually a quite sporty pickup. The bad thing is, I don't really trust the brakes, honestly. I think we might be the first people ever to drive with the T-Rex on the racetrack. It's cheating. <laughs> the truck kind of likes it, honestly. Yeah. I don't know if I can go this fast with the trailer, honestly. <laughs> I think this is a pretty bad idea to do this with the trailer. Yeah. Two, two, two minutes. Two, two minutes. Two minutes, exactly. Yeah. Let's cool down the brakes and the car a little bit. And we're going to take the trailer and then we'll see how it goes. Uh, we have our little stunt. Stunt. Our friends inside here. Yeah. This is Thomas and this is Jessica. We have to make it a bit more cozy for them so that they feel at home. Have some dinner plates because they eat something. Yeah, Jessica. I know, I know. Don't worry, Jessica. So, Jessica is filming for us. Thomas is. Thomas has his safety belt on, so it's all good. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Camping in Extreme with a fucking trailer on the racetrack. Oh, no heap noise, Klavi. Yeah. Jessica! Let's get good. Stop them. Oh, that's all man! Hey, my hanger is on the side of the wall! On the side, I'm going to the wall. I'm Oh god, this win! My god, Hänger! Nah, Jessica! <lacht> Alter, schau, wie es sich rein dreht. Ah, die Zeitstoppung, soll, die, soll man da weiter da, oder? Ich spinn. Ich glaube, ich spinn. <lacht> Ey, was racht denn da so? Oh ja, der brennt, der Hänger brennt. Der Hänger brennt. Ja, von was? was? Der brennt. Ja, der, brennt. Oh. der Hänger brennt da drin. Oh, das gibt's ja nicht. Wir Maybe it's better if you don't take him. Brent? Hast du gesehen? Bro, I thought we're gonna pull the whistle in diesel and burn my fucking car down like yeah. did with the Ferrari. Hey, Jessica. Jessie. Hey, Jessica. Achso, die ist nie so gemacht, gell? Ne? <lacht> ja, der Johnny. Johnny schaut aus so hüft es mir. <lacht> so, I honestly didn't believe it would be that bad to drive your trailer on the racetrack. But look, it turns out you can take it to the racetrack, just maybe don't drive it as fast as we did, okay? You can race it, it's no problem. Yeah. It, was, it was a driver error, it normally doesn't happen. My mistake, I'm sorry guys. Nah, I think not. Also, we're going to slag it, so that's not. We're going to a good round.
Oder machen wir das mit Tesa? Da ist, da ist Tesa. Da unten haben wir. Okay. Ja, it's not too bad. Yeah, uh, as you can see, our trailer is working again perfectly. We're now ready for the next challenge. I have to say, this didn't really quite go to plan, but at least everything else did up to this point. Yeah, time for the next challenge. Hello and welcome back. This today is going to be our last challenge for the trailer. Today is going to get a bit rough, I guess. I mean, the racetrack was already pretty much the maximum, but we're going to push it even further today. We're going to take it off-roading in this forest back there. And then afterwards, we're going to take it to a quarry to test out the sideways driving capabilities. Because we saw it on the racetrack that the trailer likes to slide around a little bit, which is very cool. So we're going to see how that works. Come with me really quick. So far, the trailer has been holding up pretty great. And honestly, um, this is the best thing ever. We only had some issues here on the racetrack because wind was coming in here. So it blew the complete sides off. But we fixed this very professionally with this here. Also, what do you say about my nice new hoodie? The shop went probably already online by the time this video is finished. Mike, could you do so a half here? Anyway, you can buy this hoodie, maybe, maybe not. Maybe it's already sold out. We'll find out. Let's focus on the main priority today, which is destroying things. And when it comes to destroying things, Ulle is the right person. So we came to Ulle. Driving to the Ulle's new camping area right now. Das ist einfach ein Okay, I think we have uh, enough forest testing. Let's take it to some gravel pit and see how it slides. Because yeah. I think if we do this any longer, we might not have a camper van anymore. Yeah. So I think we need more ratchets. Yeah. And then we can maybe continue our. I don't feel my opposite, but. Honestly, the forest was amazing for the trailer. It held up uh, amazing. Yeah. It didn't break or anything at all. This is um, supposed to be like this because you can get some fresh air into it and it's a very easy fix. It's nothing to worry about, okay? It's, it's not broken or anything. If somebody wants this trailer, I might sell it for like 5,000 euros. Just text me on Instagram. I really like it. I can't get rid of it, but I just really want something like a really good trailer because I found out that camping is now my life and I'm a full-time camper now. I'm going to sell every car to get the collection of campers. Welcome to the wonderful playgrounds. You might remember this place from the GTR video. And yeah, we're back at the exactly same spot. We're gonna test the sideways capabilities of my trailer now, because this is, I think, the most important part. I think it's gonna be amazing.
that the trailer is not really made for drifting, which is quite sad. And honestly, now I don't want one trailer anymore. I don't want to go camping. Honestly, I'm very disappointed that this didn't drift like it did. So now officially for me, camping is over. I hate this shit. Let's get rid of it proper way. And there's only one way to do it. Yeah. Okay, so I have literally no idea if this is gonna work, but our plan is we are starting this car. We have a huge rock that's on the gas pedal. I have this for the clutch. We have this for the handbrake. We fix the steering wheel. The trailer is in the back of the car. And ideally it's going to, ideally it's going to fly down here, down this cliff. And then we fly down here. I don't really know if this is gonna work, but we'll see. <laughs> Maybe we should have cleaned the trailer first before we did that. Yeah. <laughs> ah, now I'm happy. Money. That was the best camping trip I've ever had in my entire yeah. life. I loved every second of it. I can't wait to go camping again with you, Money. That was yeah. so cool, honestly. It was awesome. <laughs> I really wish that we find another trailer. Because yeah. I really want to do this again. Maybe next year? I can't wait to go camping again, honestly. That was the most chilled and most relaxing. Wow, it was amazing. I had no stress. I had no worries. It was just the best days of my life. Yeah, it was amazing. It was so calm and chill. Yeah, I'm, I'm really feeling good. Yeah, I'm also feeling good. Yeah. It was like vacation. The throwback, the mountain roads, the camping. It was amazing. That was so great. Yeah. I can't wait for our next adventure, guys. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this quite different video. We had some fun. See you at the next video or what? Well, see you at the next video. Yeah, I <laughs> guess here are some outtakes for you as well. <laughs> okay, bye. It's time to decorate. Was hängt mit der Buhr? Hallo, Servus! Wollen Sie auch was zum Essen? <lacht> Steak gibt's, Filetsteak. Was feiert's denn? Das war, dass wir hochkommen sind. Dass wir hochkommen sind. <lacht> Super! Das haben wir gekocht beim Hochfahren. Ja, erst Ringstand hat gekocht und wir sind hochgefahren. Oh. <lacht> Lasst euch gut schmecken. Dankeschön, schönen Tag noch. Servus. Tschüss. Danke. Danke, servus. Ching. <lacht> Jetzt sind wir noch Mühe im Hinten. Ey, oh, der Hax! <lacht> Die Chaos Camper sind unterwegs, ja. Herr Kellner! Komme! Du warst Eltern! Boah, Etzer! Etzer! Ich bin so froh, dass wir hier sind. Es ist sehr praktisch für jedes Event, weil du die Toilette überall gehen kannst. Du siehst alle Dixie-Klos weg. Sie sind alle voll. Ich gehe zu meiner Toilette. Ja.